are you ready for the greatest appetizer of your carne asada? You can have it as a side dish and it's perfect to have on a tortilla like a taquito. Oh my God, these grilled poblanos filled with cheese are super easy to make and they are extra delicious. And I'm, I'm glad you're here because you are really gonna enjoy putting the grill on today. Okay, this is super easy to make. For this recipe, you will need some poblano chiles, you will need toothpicks and the cheese that you choose. You can use any melting cheese. I will suggest mozzarella or chihuahua cheese. That is the Mexican melting cheese. There is also another kind of cheese called queso fresco that you can use. Okay, now poblanos, they have already some lines marking their body. So just go, just cut across the poblano. <laughs> All across the poblano. And make sure that it's just a fine line. We're gonna open it a little and we're gonna get rid of the seeds inside the poblano. Be careful with this because we want the poblano to stay as much close as it can be so we don't have the melting cheese going through the grill, okay? So get rid of the seeds and then we're gonna fill it with the cheese that you have choose. Okay, I have some mozzarella over here. I also am filling another, another ones with chihuahua or I can mix both cheeses if I want. And now we are gonna make a plastic surgery on this poblano. Just take it the toothpicks and we are gonna cross them over through the line that we cut. This to take the edges together and prevent the, from the, prevent the cheese from going through the grill, to going out from the poblano. After that, uh, we're gonna take a napkin. You are gonna put some olive oil or whatever vegetable oil you have handy. And we are gonna spread it with the napkin through the chili. You just need a little. This is gonna help us to burn the skin of the of the poblano. And that's it. We are ready to go onto the, onto the grill. We're gonna put this on top of the grill and it depends on how high is the fire on your grill, how hot it is, but it will probably take between seven and 10 minutes to burn the skin on the on the chili, okay, on the poblano. So you want it to look a little black, a little burnt, and then you're gonna flip it over on each and every side of the poblano and so you can, you can have it cook, all right? And this is ready, this is ready. You can have it over a tortilla. The skin of the poblano is super easy to take off you once you have it. And you can also eat it, there is no problem with that. So I told you it was super easy. And it's a great appetizer to have before the meat or to have it as a side dish with your carne asada, believe me everybody's gonna love it just have some tortillas handy so you can put it as a taco and amigos enjoy because i'm sure you are gonna love it I told you this was super easy and it's super delicious. I hope you enjoy it. I have new recipes in English every Thursday and Sunday here at Las Recetas de Laura. You can follow me on Instagram as well at Las Recetas de Laura and I see you la semana que viene next week with more delicious recipes.